Bim! Guess what? It's drink time. And, um, well, I'll be honest with you. Um, Pillerstein Phil, he's gone until we start doing gin again, which I think will be a while off. Uh, so in the meantime, you'll have to put up with me. But we are going to try some cider. We've got four bottles of cider from Thatcher's. Um, we're going to do, obviously, one at a time. And they're going to go in the Let's Drink in 4K playlists. But obviously, I'm only going to do one at a time. So the first one I'm going to do is Thatcher's Rascal. Now, I'll be honest with you, I'm not a cider drinker. I don't drink it all of the time. I'm not a cider drinker, but I'm going to try this one. It's Refreshing Amber Somerset Cider. Now, Thatcher's have been going for a long while. Um, and there's a story to it as well. Look there, you can see. You can see, there you go. Um, so you could read that if you want. Go on the website, whatever. Um, it's 4.5%, 500 millilitres, between two and two pounds, 80. Uh, but you buy four bottles, you only pay for three, which is why you've got four coming up. And this is number one of the four. But like I say, just look in the playlists. Um, it's got a decent lid on it as well, which I do like. I do like a decent lid. Um, so we've got the uh, the big ice cubes. So we're tipping in. Try to do a bit of Philistine Phil because he go mad when he watches these, and I don't do it right. Wow! You smell the fruit from here. Does look a little bit like a sample, but I'm sure it'll taste lovely. I didn't realise cider froths quite so much, but I'm not an expert on these things. Like I said before, I don't drink a lot of cider. So, uh, yep, there you go. That's your, that's your rascal. It smells very summery, very fruity. Uh, chin chin. That is crisp. It's nicely refreshing as well. So Thatcher's Rascal, I'm gonna give them four Stars, good start. Will it be the best one out of the four? Bim, guess what? It's summer. No. Uh, and that could only mean one thing. Parties! There ain't no party like an S Club party. Well, maybe there is, I don't know. Um, but there's certainly no party without Thatcher's Blood Orange Cider. Or is there? I'm going to review it. Um, Thatcher's Red Blood Orange Cider. Cider with natural flavouring. At Thatcher's, we're proud to craft great tasting cider. Bloody, 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 blah. So there you go. There's all the bump that you can read if you want. And it's a uh, four percent volume, five hundred milliliters, around about two quid. This is a second of the four that I'm doing, of the uh, Thatcher's ones. Uh, a nice lid on it as well, as you can see. So, this time feels still off. Don't know where he's gone. I don't really care. It's better off without him, to be fair. Right, I'll try and do what he does, but I can't do it as well. It's a little bit like Lucas said. Thatcher's blood orange. Engine. It's quite refreshing and crisp. Yeah, that's, that's actually quite nice. We'll give Thatcher's blood orange cider. Four out of five. Bim! Guess what? Philistine Phil's buggered off again. Um, and we've got some alcohol we need to review. It's the third of the four Thatcher's um, ciders. And this is Thatcher's Rosé Sweet Sparkling Somerset Cider. Um, Thatcher's Rosé is a sparkling Somerset cider blended with sweet red dessert apples such as Crips, Pink, Fuji and Gala. Best served chilled. Well, I mean, I've got my shirt open so I'm a bit chilled. Um, spoiling. Say, so, British summer, eh? Who knew? Right, so let's give it into the glass. Plenty of ice. Make. 
See, Phil Sam Phil's here, be able to tell you whether or not that's any mate rosé wine. That is very, very crisp. Very, very tasty as well. Thatcher's rosé wine. I'm going to give you five out of five. Five stars out of five. Amazing. This is number four of four. This is Thatcher's Haze. Now, if you have too much Thatcher's, that's what your brain goes like. A bit hazy. Um, it's cloudy and it's got bits floating in it. I'm not a big fan of bits, I'll be honest with you. But it's called Haze for a reason, I suppose. So I'll give it a mix up. Um, it's 4.5. And it was part of the same as uh, purchases numbers one and two. So, haze. It was very apple -y, but it would be because it's cider. Thatcher's Haze is a cloudy premium cider crafted with specially selected eating apples to create a crisp, sweet, sweet fresh uh, finish. Sorry. It is. The juice of the jungild apple that brings naturally cloudy appearance to the cider, i.e. the bits that float around in it, which you can't see now. Are there any in there? No, but it is cloudy. You can see it's cloudy. So how it goes. It's okay. Not fun of the bits though, so I'll give it, I know it's, that's what it's all about, but I'll give it four out of ten. Till next time. Bye.